Speaking after the Home Ministry's monthly gathering in Putrajaya, the Deputy Premier added authorities are still hunting down the four suspects who have been identified in the case, on the possibility that the murdered man's gang would retaliate in a very public manner, that Tutsri Zahid, who is also the Home Minister, said police are ready to face it. However, the Deputy Prime Minister declined to name the two groups or specify the reason behind the clash. Mangsa dan empat orang itu memang dua kumpulan kawasan gelap yang berbeza dan kita yakin ada terdapat uh, perselisihan antara dua kumpulan kenaan dan sebagaimana diketahui bahawa pihak polis akan terus mengambil tindakan kepada semua kumpulan kawasan gelap. On Sunday, the man who was in his 30s died after being stabbed by assailants and run over by a car at a petrol station in Taman Pelangi, Johor. The entire gory incident was caught on video and the clip has since gone viral on WhatsApp and social media. A special task force has also been set up by Bukit Aman to probe the case. However, further details on the identity of the slain man has yet been disclosed by police. His funeral is expected to be held on Thursday.